We have now got a new system for treatment of heart disease. After a heart attack, <coughs> we can get you back to normal with natural methods. And one of my patients, doctor patients in Pune, he has taken this forwards, one Vinod Marathe, he has taken it forwards and we have now got lot of drugs which are accepted as treatment for heart disease after a heart attack. All this I am telling you because it takes courage, courage of conviction and they oppose the main line, main, main stream which Pramod has done very well and I hope Pramod will really get, become a great man and take knowledge forwards in the world and now knowledge has really gone forwards in medicine that diabetes can be controlled without any effort on the part of the doctor and the medicine. And this is a very great improvement. So, you know, like for example, in the olden, olden days also it's like that. Ptolemy said in the second century, sun goes around the world. For five or more centuries, everybody repeated that sun goes around the world, sun goes around the world, sun goes around the world. Knowledge didn't go forwards. In seventh century, Copernicus said, earth goes around the sun. And then knowledge went forwards. So today, knowledge has gone forwards in diabetes. Because Pramod said, diabetes can be treated without any drugs. How true. I want more Pramod and more Indians in the Indian scenario. We don't want American thinkers here. Unfortunately, what happened after our independence, political independence, we didn't have intellectual independence. We still are slaves of the Western thought. I was fighting this cholesterol ghost for last 50 years. And I opposed cholesterol, the thought of cholesterol being bad for health, etc. for 50 years. And there's so much of effort to put me down. Actually, you'll be surprised. In 84, I was giving a lecture in American College of Cardiology in Boston. After I talked, the senior most professor came down and told me, Dr. Hegde, do you have any other work in Boston? I said, no. No, you better go because it's already 4 o'clock. It will be dark by about 5 o'clock in Boston. And the soya lobby is so powerful here and they will bump you off. And that was the threat. You would be surprised. But today I am so happy after 50 years. America says cholesterol is a friend, cholesterol is not bad, cholesterol is good. Actually, in India we have been treating diabetics with, with the, what do you call cholesterol lowering drug called statin. And we now know that statin pills, if you give it to 10 people, one of them will become a diabetic in one year time. Today in India there are 15, one, 15 million people taking statin. That means we are manufacturing 1.5 million diabetics every year. So that's why we say oh, India is the diabetic capital of the world. Because we are manufacturing diabetes. So now that America says cholesterol is not bad, I think this ghost will also go. So with Pramod's effort, the two ghosts have died in the area of diabetes. A, well, statin, B, the other drugs. And one other thing I'll tell you, this is a secret, don't tell others, don't go out and tell this, and don't tell the media people, please don't report this. Every drug that I give to a patient, there are two things you must know. A, if I give a drug to you, it doesn't mean it helps you, because we only have statistical data. So we have, we have a group, this, this group it helps. So there's what's called NNT, number needed to treat unnecessarily to have one effect. Take, for example, blood pressure tablet. If I give you a blood pressure lowering tablet, if you have blood pressure, you don't know, I don't know that whether you get the benefit. I have to give 850 people that tablet unnecessarily benefit one patient in the next five years. So that's called the NNT number needed to treat. So when I give you a blood pressure lowering tablet, you get one in 800 chance of getting benefit. Okay, then you say, okay, all that doesn't matter. Even then I'll take it. If you, you can take it, but what's the ADR ratio, what's the risk ratio? Every drug has dangerous side effects and blood pressure tablet is a 2%. That means out of the 850 that I have given unnecessarily, 2%, that is 16 people will die in the next 5 years of my tablet. And one man will be saved from blood pressure lavages. If everybody is told this about every drug that he or she is taking, many people won't take the drugs at all. And Pramod has done a very good thing in diabetes because most of the diabetic drugs are dangerous. And some of them damage your kidney completely. And some of them damage your heart. 
especially you know some some drugs very very popular drugs like metformin they damage the kidneys completely but doctors are so fond of them that they give huge doses because they just want to see the report patients are also happy with the report how do they feel whether they are alive or dead they don't know but their report must be nice so they are only going after the report and saying this is my report and there again we lower the report every day to keep the drug companies happy uh, there was a time when the pp sugar should, should be 180 and fasting sugar would be 120 when i was a student that was level it came down gradually because more companies produce drugs so it came down came down came down and it came down so low that they said okay 180 etc etc now this is all happening because of the industrial pressure so the medical industry in the west runs the medical treatment methods and they have the guideline committees and recently they found that every guideline committee member takes millions of dollars of bribe from the drug companies and they write it for the benefit of the drug company rather than for the benefit of the patient and our doctors follow the american guidelines i always tell them don't follow the guidelines because guidelines are not genuine they are not scientific they are just business but no you can't convince our doctors it's very difficult to convince our doctors so friends i was so happy and thrilled when i came here yesterday to find out what is happening here because i didn't know muktotsava I, I was thinking i was so confused what is this muktotsava in medicine but then when these two people came to my room in the hotel yesterday and explained what they are doing i was so thrilled I, I tell you i slept so well i was very comfortable and all my effort has come to fruition and i'm very happy that i came here in spite of all my disabilities and difficulties because I don't think there is any other, any other conference like this that I had the opportunity to talk to. This is a unique opportunity and of course this, this beautiful girl told me you will speak last because you can speak till the cow, cows go home. We will all go for lunch by about 1.30. So I got the cue and my attender is telling me that it's already 1.30, so we better stop. So now he's, he's giving me a clue, which Thomas Jefferson's uncle gave him when he became the President of the United States of America. He said, Thomas, you normally give long-winded speeches. Now, now on, now that the President, you stand up, speak up and shut up. So I will follow that policy. I stood up and I spoke up something, whatever it's right or wrong, I don't know. But one thing I'm happy that I associated myself with this because this, I have never seen any effort like this in medicine anywhere in the world. <laughs> Pramod, may God bless you. May you live long. May your tribe increase. And may you be very happy to continue this effort. Extend this further to other areas also. Actually, if we think in, on Indian lines, we can give muktotsava in heart disease, muktotsava in diabetes, muktotsava in cancer, and muktotsava in various other diseases. I hope we have that effort going on in other areas also. Thank you for your lead. Even I have been working in this area for the last half a century, but I never thought of this kind of an effort. I have a lot of patients who are, who are not on drugs, I have taken them off drugs, but there are not hundreds, thousands of them. But we have not had a, an effort like this to really highlight that area. I thank you for your guidance. Thank you very much. May God bless all of you. Thank you.